What's up, people? Welcome back to another episode. I wanted to start this one out just a little bit different with a little bit of music, upbeat, mowing, and weed eating Granny's yard. I mowed all the way down a road, which is about a quarter mile. Did that a few strips and have it nice and clean. And then same thing back here. Everything is knocked down. I haven't weed eated out here in a while. So it took me about an hour of weed eating, but I got it all nice and mowed down. I know Granny will appreciate it, even if she doesn't know that I'm the one doing it or not. But uh, when you have a grandmother like that, you need to take care of them and help them out as much as possible. And then we have this section over here as well that I mowed. Uh, this is where the cattle are. They have eaten down a lot of it. And then in the nine acres over there in her pasture as well. But came in and got the zero turn, mowed all around as much as I could. I didn't get to weed eat over there. It's about waist high. So I'll have to come back and do that on another video. But about an acre or so uh, mowed and weed eat. Very, 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 very happy with the progress on that. And I know once again that Granny will be and the rest of the family as well when they come to visit granny they can see a nice maintained yard so anyways i'm gonna get back to the house i think we're gonna go ahead and put in those water lines so i'm gonna take a quick break and then we'll meet back up hopefully at my yard and hopefully these pipes are unfrozen so we can get these things rolled out and buried inside my yard so we don't have to worry about mom tripping on my water lines anymore all right so as promised on the last video i was going to show matt doing a little bit of cooking i'm gonna leave him be let him do his thing for the most part i just wanted to show y'all what he's got going on over here what's up bubba everybody's been asking what's going on people? they want to see grilling grilling and chilling grilling grilling and chilling got some little beef ribs up there got a little mixed uh bag of goodies here some sausage mushrooms potatoes peppers got some corn all right, like I said, I promised you I was going to show a quick clip of Matt. That's about all he can stand on YouTube. But it's awesome weather today. What do you think, Mother? Beautiful. 61 degrees and sunny. Can't beat it. 61 and sunny? Sunny. You're supposed to say it's still cold, so we don't have to go do the water lines. Oh, no. Y'all need to get up there while it's warm and get it done. <laughs> Uncoil those lines. So I spent the last two hours mowing and weeding it. Grannies, as y'all saw, I get home. And Dad said, let's go put the water lines in. I said, I just worked two hours. Give me a, a quick break. I was like, come on, man. I went in, ate something real quick, edited that part of the video, and now we're back out here. We're going to go see, it now that it's 61, now that Mom admitted it and said, saying it was like 32, so we didn't have to do it. <laughs> you know, you've been spicing up my videos a lot lately. <laughs> yeah, I'll just stay over here today while y'all go over there. Yeah, you stay I'm away. I'm good. Look, my palms aren't bruised or anything. You know, I'm shocked that not one person said that I was mean for laughing at you. I, I was, I was actually did. shocked. I think did somebody they? did, yeah. Oh, well, I would I was get up 74 today. 74, all right. That's what it says. Now, I wouldn't have, I would not have filmed mom if I knew she right was hurt. I know it. If you were hurt, I wouldn't have done that. But you face planted and had a mouthful of dirt and I just couldn't help myself. And 70 degrees. Right 70 degrees? If you're wondering what that beanie is, I kept making fun of Dad on it. It's a Miami ink. It's a, uh, it tattoo. was a TV show and a tattoo shop, so. And it's not his either. He's got a little more street cred now, so. <laughs> Anyways, I guess we're gonna walk over to my place and we're gonna see if these uh, pipes are good enough. Somebody said, Dad, that we should put oh, a, Mom. somebody said we should put a two by four in there yeah, just unroll and it. just do it to roll it, so. Yeah. We'll might do that. Hopefully everything's good. Stay tuned, let's find out.
right, just like that, we got most of it buried in. He'll come back in and clean everything up real good. I know mom will be very excited to not see big holes in the yard again. <laughs> we need to get through with this and cover it all up. Huh? Get through and cover it all up. Yeah, we don't need any more accidents out here, but overall, it's getting covered, so we'll be able to get that fence up most likely today over here in this section, and then we'll go ahead and work inside my fence and get all that knocked out as well, so stay tuned. All right, we just got back out here. I swear, you can't stop these people from working out here. Look, it's even moms out here trying to get plastic off these things. They want me out of this house now. Anyways, we just got done eating. I was trying to film Matt. He made some shish kebabs and other stuff, and halfway through the clip, it just stopped for some reason, so you didn't get to see the shish kebabs. They are pretty good. I'm wearing half of it on my shirt. Uh, they were very juicy, and my shirt soaked it up real nice. But anyways, I guess I should suppose I should stop talking and... Uh, Get to work. Yeah, help them get back to work. So once again, uh, real quick, we're just gonna go up to the fence over here so we can get the uh, goats back out here. That's what the goal is for today. And then we'll work inside my property probably on the next video. So anyways, now I'm gonna stop talking. Let's get to work. Just like that, we got it covered up. Shout out to mom for getting in the trenches over there and helping us out. No 
problem. A little, little muscle, extra power. <laughs> like the hat, by the way, Mom. But uh, anyways, Dad just going back and backfilling it. We did right at about 200 feet. We wanted to go all the way up to the corner of my fence over here so we could put the uh, goat fencing back up and get them back out here. So this is pretty much all we're going to get done for this video, I think. Uh, or I might actually get the tractor while I have it out and pull that tree out of my pond up in the front. And then I got to go back in and cut some of these stumps out or the uh, roots out of my trenches. I know somebody commented that on the video as well. So I do read y'all's comments. I may not respond to everybody, but uh, I do respond. I'm going to try to pin comments that I like to the top. And uh, on the last video, I pinned a gentleman. Uh, so y'all should go there and check that out. Give him a comment. Tell him thank you for uh, helping out my algorithm and commenting. So anyways, uh, I guess once we're done covering everything up completely, we'll check back in. It's going to take just a second, though. All right, guys, we are done for today. Still needs a little bit more dirt work back here, but uh, I do want to point out one thing. Back over there, you probably can't see it too good. There's a mound of dirt. We left the section open where we put the uh, two pipes together, the coupling. We want to make sure that there's no leaks on it when we actually get the water running out here. So I'll show you real quick up here. We put the T-post in. I got to right dig it out just a hair more, but... Yeah, I covered it up a little bit. <laughs> yeah, um, anyways. Uh, what we're going to do, we're going to have the county come out and dump some dirt for us. We'll fill in this area since this is a low spot over here. I guess I should show y'all where I'm pointing. Yeah. This section over here. And then... Uh, we're going to also dig down in here more. We're over here, guys. We're over here. You got to talk to the camera. They're the ones listening. Back down over here. We're going to be digging out more down by the little crosswalk and where the boat was. Yeah, Put that was... Up on here too. <clears throat> this portion of the pond is a little bit shallower than the rest of it, so we need to dig that out. Uh, other than that, I guess we're going to pretty much call this a video for now. The next video we're going to finish inside the fence. We wanted to get this section done once again to get the goats back out here. We did leave uh, the pipe over here coiled up at the back side of my fence. We're going to put in a faucet there. So when we do get the animals over here, we can just run some water uh, straight up to their barn or whatever we decide to build. So yeah. anyways, uh, you got anything else you want to tell them or update them on? No, just uh, stay tuned. And just watch us keep going. Yeah, I mean, we'd love to get back to the build, but we need to get this stuff done while it's still nice weather before right. it freezes again, if it does, and uh, makes it a little bit easier to get around and a little safer for everybody. So well, at least we got it over here so that we can do yeah. work and put the fence back up for the goats. Yeah. So anyways, appreciate you guys for watching. I think we're uh, we're over 101,000 now. I didn't even know that yeah, we good. passed up that. So appreciate you guys for watching. The ones stick around forever. You guys, God bless your souls. You've been sticking around for this long. And then the newbies, I promise you, I'm not as crazy as I seem. So anyway, if I'm crazy, that means I get it from someone. So anyways, hope you guys enjoy the video. We will catch you on the next one. Uh, Matt wants a quick shot on the video and peace. <laughs>